Hey guys, you're watching you one and only. My name is AJ. Welcome back to another episode of Let's Build a City today. We're doing something that is very, very overdue. There's a lot of things in the city that are overdue being built, but today we're going to be working on the train stations. We've got this beautiful elevated railway that goes around the city in basically a giant square. But there's no way to actually get onto it at the moment. So we're going to have to build some sort of staircase to get up. And some sort of rudimentary, relatively basic uh, station up the top here. In a very sort of Grand Theft Auto, Liberty City style is what I'm thinking. Because I remember that from GTA 3. Uh, getting up there on the uh, on the bikes or on, the, on, a, on a little moped. And then driving on the rails up there and trying to miss all of the trains coming in the other direction. I was going to do a... <laughs> opening with me driving the train so i went to go and delete the train because you have to delete these trains every time that you log out of the world for some reason because all of the seats turn into giant uh, question marks that don't go away and don't let the train move so i went to go and punch the train i hit the rail i destroyed the rail i then spent about half an hour trying to fix it i can't no longer do this corner i can't remember how i done the corners because this mod is just driving me insane it always did drive me insane from the very beginning so i need to figure out how exactly i need to do that again <laughs> until then though we've got a missing corner Anyway, I digress. Let's go on to building the track now, or the station. What I would like to do, what I think would be a good idea, would be to have four stations around the elevated railway. One on this side, one on that side, one on the back side, and one on the right side. It just makes sense. It's not too far between each other. They're not so close that it sort of is pointless. And it could be another way to get around the city if, I, if the train mod doesn't actually start messing up on me again. So... I think here is about the only spot that we've got free down this road here or down this side of the railway uh, that could actually be used for. So what I want to have is a little spiral staircase that comes up here and goes to a sort of platform on one side with a little bit of a shelter or a shroud. And then some sort of bridge possibly it's going to be tight to get the bridge in but i'd like a bridge that goes across to the other side because obviously on this side we don't have any spiral staircase room to be able to get up there and what's the point of having two staircases on like one on either side when we could just use one and a bridge and a bridge would look cool so let's try and do that i think what we're going to do is we're going to use the cyan block as the base as it's going to blend into the track then It'll all look as one, and it does look like a nice sort of floor block. That's really glitchy. Let's turn these off to stop that from happening. And then what I want to have is also a yellow line that goes down the front as like a warning. You're getting close to the track. This is your stand back point style thing. I think if we start off with a platform, and once we've sort of got a platform size, and we'll then work on the staircase to get up here. So let's just do a rough size. Let's do the yellow blocks down here. Like so. It doesn't need to be all that big either. We want this to fit into a, a a fair few different spots, don't we? So then we'll wrap this around the side of it. Steady on now. We also don't want it to be too big because we're going to have to squeeze this into... Well, more likely you are going to have to squeeze this into a couple of areas. I thought now would be a good idea before we go any further and more buildings are built, making it even tighter. This should have been done really quite towards the beginning, but I sort of forgot about it. And then you guys reminded me, and I was like, okay, yeah, we'll do that soon. And then I forget again. And then I get a comment saying, there's no way to get onto the railway. So then I think, oh, yeah, I'll do it this episode. And then I forget, and I end up building something else. <laughs> so it's a vicious cycle, but we're getting it done. We're doing it. See? I listen to you guys. How far back do we want to go? We don't really need to go all that far back. What we do need to do is make sure that we've got enough room to fit the staircase in. And make sure that we've got enough room to fit uh, an entrance to a bridge on. Which is going to be... I mean, one block wide for the path is the smallest we can do. But then we're going to have to have one block on either side of that as some sort of railing. Some sort of walls to stop you from falling off the bridge and onto the track. We can just use uh, iron bars for that. Uh, let's try and get that in. If we get some stairs, some stairs that somewhat stand out just a little bit. Uh, so something like maybe these lighter ones. They have, they have a block that we're using here as well. But just as a, as a little bit of a standout block. Let's, let's stick with the one block wide staircase for the minute. We need to make sure that we're high enough above this that the train won't hit it. Can I get a train down just to see? 
You know, I hate this because you can never see actually what... Let me out. <laughs> They're so loud. <laughs> uh, that's pretty close. If I can go up one more... That will clear it. Okay, now I'm going to have to try and get rid of this train now because it's so loud in my ear. Don't look down. I don't want to remove the track. I hate this mod. It was such a bad idea doing this. I've broken a block already. Okay, we'll have to... Ha! <laughs> i done it. I hate it. It's such a bad mod. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. Maybe someone has a, another mod, uh, another train mod that works better than this. Uh, you guys recommended uh, RTM, which is real train mod, to me when I first looked for a mod uh, that allowed me to do train stuff with. But... Um, I looked into it and I got this one, but it's a Japanese, uh, it only comes as a Japanese mod, uh, which makes it extremely difficult to understand anything about it. And uh, I think I need something else. I couldn't find, at the time, I couldn't find another train mod that I liked. Uh, there was a couple of out there that were, like, just bad. Um... But maybe, maybe some of you new subscribers or, or some of you have looked into it a little bit more. Maybe some of you have got uh, a better mod that you use for yourself. And uh, please let me know about it if you've got one. Uh, I, I'm not really, in all honesty, I'm not really that bothered anymore about like the looks and stuff like that. If it's just a train mod that works. And by that I mean a track that you put down and then a train that you put on the tracks. I want to be able to drive it, and when you get in the train, all you got to do is hold forward, like, and it'll just follow the tracks, which is what exactly what this does. But to place the tracks down, it's not, it's so complicated, it's not what you would think. You'd think it would just be a simple, like, track block, wouldn't you? No, 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 there's markers and all sorts that you have to put down first, and it's awful, I... I cannot explain. Unless you've played with that mod, I, you will not understand how awful it is. Okay, I like that. I like that as a staircase that goes up and around. We'll do the other side momentarily. So we should put those in. And one more. We'll, we'll, we'll go to here. Now, obviously, the opposite end to the bridge is where the staircase is going to be. So now that we've got this, we'll try and fit the, the staircase down. For this... I have a little bit of a cheat because I can use these uh, scaffolding stairs as a really nice coil. They coil really well, actually, because um, they're really small. You can do it with stairs or slabs or something, but it would take you a little bit longer. I'm going to use these. Uh, I think these are exactly the same as those. They're just in a different... These are Flenix Cities. These are RTM. So if I use the Flenix City ones, it'll probably be better because if I do end up uninstalling the um, RTM mod... And replace it, then uh, I'm going to need to then replace all the stairs about, aren't I? So I think with this mod, you can go down, or, or with these stairs, you can go down in a 2x2. Two two, but I think it would be better in a 3x3. Three three. We'll do it there. That sounds about right. So we definitely want the uh, staircase to probably come up there. And then we come down again. And then we go into the slab that we have at the bottom. So we're going to use quartz slabs like that and then we come down again slab nope slab on the bottom half and then we come down again slab slab on the bottom half that one slab and then we'll do a little pole that goes up the middle so it doesn't look like it's quite as floaty as this i don't mind where the bottom ends up being because we'll just do a little sort of platform area down here Ooh, ooh. We're actually a little bit too close. I didn't realise that. I thought we would have been well over the side by now. Okay. Um, can I move these? Can I just do that and that? Cut. Oh, I nearly got it all. Uh, I need to go to here. Oops. 
Yeah, now I'll end up in the right place. Okay, that's actually a lot bigger than I thought. Is that a good thing? Do I want it to be out this far? Oh, wrong one. We'll just try it. We'll see. I uh, just need to add these ones back again. That one. And then down to the floor. Once we've done this once, I shouldn't need to do it again. I should just be able to copy and paste the entire station, I'm hoping, or at least nearly the entire station uh, around the map. And uh, and it'll be done with. So that that's the plan. Uh, and then another one like that. I mean, how perfect is that? Uh, I can I just put them there? No, hang on. I hang on. There's a better one. Um, platform? No. Um, Flenic. Is it at Flen? No. How do I search just a mod? Flenic City Road sidewalks. Road tools? Nope. Nope. Uh, where are the stairs from? Stairs. There is the platform for these. Uh, what colour is this one? If I do white. Where's the platform one? White skyscraper corner post. These are the posts to hold it up. Yeah, here. Perfect. Look at that. And then we don't need the slabs there. It puts all of the corners in for us. So people can't even fall out on the way up. Oh, sweet. Oops. Oops. Always click on the one going up. Not on the one going down. That one. That one. Yeah, boy. Look at that. Oh, sweet. Okay, and then how do we now then... This can come out all the way to here now. And then we want it to obviously go around here. Because I think it'll just look better. Something like that. And I'll put like a uh, cobblestone wall. We'll have a... Uh, no, I think I could just get away with doing the cobblestone walls around there like this. And then I'll put that in either like that or just put like a, a block in. Yeah, I like the block. Block in there. And then a block in here that goes a couple of blocks higher. Two blocks higher. Nope. I'm going to do it back down to that size, but I'll have it as a T. I'll have it as a peak, so it'll be something like... Like that. I think that would look sick. I think that would look really, really cool. We'll use some kind of stair or something like that. Uh, okay, and then that's going to come across there. I think that would work really quite well. Oh. Mm. Okay, I'll add one more block. One more block along here. And then... That'll have, that, that will have to work somehow. We'll have a, a middle point of two, won't we? Yeah, I mean, that, that that can work. That can work. This come down here. I can still get onto the platform nicely. That will be nice. That one, that one, that one, that one, that one. And then that one, that one, that one, that one. And then I'll somehow join. I might have to move the bridge back by one or something like that to get it in there. That'll work out great. Okay, let me put the roof on. I'll move the bridge back. Oh no, what is the time? Oh wow, we're getting actually on a little bit. No, I don't. I don't really want to cut away from you guys. Let's just do this. Uh, cut. Move it back a little bit. Paste. There we go. So now we can. Put this where it's supposed to, or, or put this back to where it's supposed to be. I don't know how we're going to do the roof to get around the staircase, uh, the, the bridge area. But I think that would work. I think that would be good. We'll have these running down the side there. And down this side. We want some sort of seating. Just a little bit of seating, nothing too much. Uh... 
couch. Just some wooden seats up here. Just do one big bench, can't we? Two blocks in from the end on that side. Two blocks in from the end on this side. Let's do three and three. So a nice big sort of seating bench in there. I think that looks good. <laughs> I think that's looking all right. All right. Uh, and then for the roof on here, you know, full blocks don't actually look that bad. What do we have in stairs? I mean, a wooden one could work. Let's try it. I, when I was thinking about this, I, I didn't really think of wood, to be fair. Uh, no, I definitely want that there. I think I'm going to sit the wood on, on this. Like that. Yeah, that could work. And then I, I might... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I'm going to put all the wood across. I can do that now because it's just going to be a straight shot. And then we'll do some sort of beaming work with these. So when you're underneath, it looks quite interesting. I'll be back. All right, so I'm just sort of fixing up the roof uh, where we actually come through. Now, I'm just going to sort of leave it a little bit open like that. I think that looks pretty cool and it works. I like it from the outside as well. Just a little hole in the roof there. Uh, and then what we can do now is underneath, like I said, we'll just do a little bit of framework. So we'll have one that runs down... Obviously, the bottom side of each. Down here. I want to use full blocks and not cobblestone walls. I want it to be a little bit chunky, a little bit stronger. And then we'll do one, I think, uh, like two diagonals up on this one here. And obviously, we're only going to be able to go up to a certain point on the other side. We should be fine here. But then on this side, I can go all the way to there. Can I still get under the stairs there? Yeah, I can, yeah. Yeah, that's enough clearance. I'm happy with that. So then we'll run it down here as well. It might not look all that important, but now... But when you're underneath here now, you can actually sort of... There's actually something under here. It's not quite just boring and, and nothing going on. So yeah, I like that. Now we just need to get out of here. Got to go out the front because of the cobblestone walls. And put these upside down. Pew, 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 pew. Pew, pew, pew. Now comes the interesting part of being able to copy this. <laughs> it's not going to go well, is it? Let's give it a go, though. We'll go from here to there. I'm going to stand right on the corner. I need to find a place that is going to work sort of everywhere. I'm going to copy it. I'm going to uh, flip it east, which is that direction. And then if I walk over here in a straight line, I stand here and paste. So far, so good. It's not going to be perfect, I don't think. But uh, this looks like it's good. There. Obviously, we want... Actually, it's pretty much as perfect as I could ever want, actually. What I've got to do is add those there, those there, and remove those. Need some pillars going down to hold the whole thing up. Uh, I should just be able to go down pretty much anywhere. We'll do a block at the top. Then we'll come down with the cobblestone walls. And then we'll finish off with a block on the bottom. I don't think we need too many of these. I mean, I've got the big posts holding that up. So if I can just do one on uh, both corners... Then I'll be happy. Let's remove that bush. And then on this side, I can do the same thing. So we can just have one here. Maybe, maybe there should be a little bit more structure to the underside of these. But for the moment, I'm quite happy. I can always come back and add more to it. Uh, oh, yeah. And then I want this post to go up the middle of the staircase. We can probably just use a full block for that. Ooh, I think that looks so cool when you're coming down there. I don't know why that one, why this one has a black. I think it's a shadow glitch, just a lighting glitch that's going on because, as you saw, they were all the same blocks. All right, that I'm really, really happy with. Right, having that in four locations around the map 
would just be amazing. Can I, though, now? Yeah, I should. I'll see about copying and pasting the whole lot, but I think that would really mess the track up. So what I'm going to have to do is just paste what I've got, which is one side of the station, and then join the bridge up in the middle and put the staircases down so let's go and find our locations together uh, we'll run down the track here and if we see somewhere that sort of works and we'll have to use it this will work for this route this one will work a little bit better because i could either do it on this side or that side it's right by the mcdonald's and it's a little bit further away from that station i think that's too close to the curve so i'm going to go right here now i need to think here I was on this side and it pasted there, but that's when I was facing this way. So I need to rotate it 90 degrees and then paste around. Flip it south and then paste it. That's the way I want it. So what I'll do is I'll just go... Oh, no. See, I told you it would mess up. I, I knew it. I knew this would be a bad idea. Uh, paste. Man, I'm going to have to fix all that now. Uh, so then if I... How? That's not south. Is it because of the rotation? Okay, maybe. Maybe it is. That... Nope. Nope, nope, that one, and this one. What I'll do is I shall join you once I've placed this down, and we'll go and find the next spot together, okay? I'll be back. Okay, there's the second station in, so let's go and find the third spot down the back side here. That's going to be a tight one because we've got a bridge really close one side of us, and then we've got an ocean or the river to go over as well. So, I don't know. We're probably going to have to. I don't know if we've even got enough room for it on the back. So, we might have to leave it. I could do it there, which is as close to as we as possible. And then have another one down on uh, by the football stadium. That would be nice. I would really like one somewhere close to there. So, I don't mind having two down here, I suppose. It's going to be close on the on that side, though. It's it's not going to be easy. Uh, okay, so if I've got that, I've copied that one. I think I copied the, the correct side. Excuse the noise. I chose the right side. Oh, I've got rid of a corner again. I chose the right side, but the wrong direction. There we go. <laughs> Is that good? Yes, yeah, fine there. It's a little tight, but that's good. And then uh, I th think I can flip south. F flip south. I did put the um, uh, staircase and everything on that other station. One over there is completely done like the first one now as well. Okay, it does fit in there. It does go in nicely. Okay, so let me uh, fix this one up and I should be back again. Okay, so there's another one. The staircases on these ones do end up being a little bit further away, unlike the first one, because the first one had the uh, T-junction there. Uh, but it's okay, because we'll just extend out uh, the path around here. Maybe even put some shrubbery, like a little bit of a nice entrance to it would be nice. Uh, but yeah, I tried to remove the train again, and I broke the track, and I hate this mod. And please, someone send me a better train mod. I'm pleading with you now. <laughs> I want something decent. See, it's missing here. I don't know how this is even missing here. I haven't even touched this side. Um, it's just a really glitchy, awful, awful mod. Uh, but anyway, anyway, anyway. Last one is here. Beautifully close to the train station. Makes a lot of sense. So, uh, yeah. I think if I go here, I can't go wrong. Perfect. I'm fine with that. Um... I'm not going to flip, though, because I've got a feeling that if I flip this, I'm going to be in real trouble because I've rotated it or something. No, I didn't. No, I should be okay. 
hang on. Uh, flip north. And make sure I stay in line, otherwise that'll be embarrassing. Yeah, okay, so there we go. And then this is where the last one's going to go. So, let me quickly again stick this down. We'll be back to have a quick fly around to see what it looks like all completed, okay? Okay, so that means all four of them are in now. Ignore the holes in the track. And let's just imagine that, you know, it's all there. On the minimap, it looks really cool, which I'm really hoping that in overview, this would look sick as well. I love how you can just see the bridge go over it. I really like the look of them. I think the spruce wood, in my wildest dreams, I, I, if I thought about it, I would have hated it. But seeing it actually in reality there, I really like the wood. I like how we've got them on both sides. I like how you access it from one side. I really like the locations. And I, if you get catch them just at the right angle... They blend into the city so well. I think they've got a really nice design to them. And you look at that when it sort of comes into view. It looks like a station, which is exactly what you want. When you're building something, you want it to look like what you're building afterwards, don't you? So I'm super, super chuffed with this. Really, really chuffed. Look at that. And that's where we're going to end today's episode. If you enjoyed it, hit that like button. If you haven't already, then feel free to subscribe. We shall see you in the next episode.